Coming up next, line marking. Entourage versus railing. Stick around to see which category wins. Hi all, my name is Serge and thank you for tuning in today. Recently, I released this video, five tips for great line marking and more specifically, how to bend line marking to topography. If you would like to check it out, click the link on your screen now. And in response, I received this comment, which basically says it's great for rendering, but for constantly changing projects, it would be very annoying. In other words, very cool, but not practical. So I thought it would be great to do a test. Entourage versus railing. There are four metrics to measure by. Number one, assembly. How easy it is to make the family. Number two, transferability. How easy it is to insert into other projects. Number three, parametrics. Can the family be easily updated? And number four, presentation. The end result, how the family performs. So make sure you stick around to the end and let's see which category comes out on top. So in this test, we analyze how easy is it to make the family. When it comes to railing for something as simple as a line demarcation, such as a car park bay, assembly is fairly easy. First, start with a profile and then add it to the rail structure. And that's it. The entourage family is much more complex, although straightforward to assemble, there is no denying that it takes many more clicks and more effort to assemble. So after the first metric, that's one zero to railing. In the next test, we analyze how easy it is to transfer to another project. Because railings are system families, they are easy to transfer to other projects. Simply open a new file, go to transfer standards, where you can pick the railing category and job done. The car park railing system is now available. With the entourage family, it's not so easy. There are definitely more steps involved. Because the family is set up as an in-place mass, you would have to export as a group and then in the new project, reinsert as a group. That group then needs to be disassembled, rehosted, and then regrouped. So again, not necessarily hard, but there are definitely more steps. And so after the second metric, railing has the upper hand 2-0. But what if things change? What if we need to thicken the lines? With railing, you'd have to create a new profile and then you'd have to duplicate the family to create a new type. Whereas the entourage has an inbuilt parameter to instantly update the thickness as shown. Or even update the width of the bay, like so. So it seems the entourage has pulled one back. So before we look at the last metric, railing still leads to one. In this test, we look at presentation or performance. More specifically, how the family conforms to a change in the topo surface. This time, we will start with the entourage. As shown, it performs quite well. I can see the whole of the line the whole time. And now, let's have a look at the railing. As I begin to move it, it seems to have lost its shape a little. Let's zoom in to have a closer look. Zooming in reveals it hasn't quite hosted as well as the entourage. So I would say that's another point to entourage, which brings our score 
to 2, 2. So there you have it, it's a draw. But if I had to declare a winner, I would pick the Entourage category. Only because I can get around the setup and transferability issues. Whereas with the railing, that can't be improved when it comes to performance. What you get is what you get. So why don't you let me know in the comments what you think. Thanks so much for watching. And if you found this video helpful, please click subscribe and I'll catch you in the next video.